everyone welcome back to another video my name is Matt Schmidt and I guide people to heal themselves um, in this video we're going to be talking about letting go of emotions I've gotten a lot of requests for this um, how do I let go how do I let go of this stuff that I'm hanging on to so I created this process so letting go of emotions is super easy with this process. I'm really excited about this because a lot of my stuff is based on how well you can visualize and stuff like that. This, it doesn't matter. It's more about the feeling. It's more about everything, um, kind of feeling, the intentions, the stuff that's coming up. And a lot of times there's not anything like visual. Um, you don't need to describe it. You just need to kind of allow it. So this is going to be more of a feeling process and we're going to just be getting those feelings to the surface. And by getting those feelings to the surface, we can release them. So often they say we have to feel to heal. Um, it's okay to feel all the feelings, just don't get stuck there. Okay, so some of this process is um, getting through over those things that maybe you've suppressed. You pushed them down, pushed them down. Doesn't mean they're not there. Doesn't make them go away. <laughs> um, they're still there. They're still affecting you and it's still still impacting your life. So as we're going through this, you may feel uncomfortable. Awesome. That means you're on the right track. <laughs> as stuff's coming up, just allow the process to come up. Allow these shitty feelings to come up. Um, it's okay. It's okay that these things are coming up because this is your chance to move past them. So by bringing them to the surface, we can be like, okay, these are, this is what I'm hanging on to. I don't need this anymore. It's allowing them to leave. Otherwise, they just stay stuck. So um, we're just going to get right into it. Okay, no thinking with this one. Just trust whatever's coming to mind first. Um, there's no right or wrong way to do this. I'm just giving you kind of a guideline, kind of a framework. Um, if you find a way that works better for you, you can go off on your own and not follow what I'm saying. That is awesome. Um, just do whatever's right for you. This is just kind of a, a general guideline. Okay, so we're just going to get right into it. Okay, so if you can find somewhere comfortable, somewhere to lay down, maybe somewhere to sit, somewhere where you're in a comfortable space for you, um, where you're not being uh, judged by anyone that's around you or anything like that, where you're not going to hold back um, in a safe space where you can release some of this stuff. Releasing this stuff can be very powerful. Um, just a, a lot of people will be crying, a lot of people will be uh, maybe getting hot, cold, and make you feel like you're vibrating, shaking, different parts of your body may be like getting your attention. That's all those patterns coming to the surface. Um, a lot of times the physical healing happens when we go through this process. So um, it's anyone, any types of these feelings and sensations is completely normal and it's a sign we struck something major. So just go with it. Whole, the whole key in this process is just to allow whatever's coming up. Don't hold any of it back. This is your chance to move past it and really become that best version of you. All right, so if you found a place that's comfortable, um, maybe some people like to do this with headphones, that's awesome. I personally like to lay down with headphones and kind of get in my own world. But we're going to just start with some intentions. Okay, intention is so huge. I'm learning more and more how important intention is. Intention is everything. So if you want, you can just kind of close your eyes. We're going to place our hands over our heart. We do that because the electromagnetic energy of the heart is about a thousand times of that of the head. So we're going to just grow that, that electromagnetic energy of the heart. Put our awareness there. And then you can just repeat out loud or repeat in your head. I intend to let go of everything that no longer serves my highest good. All right, now take a big, slow, deep breath. And as you exhale, feel the relaxation flow from your head all the way down to the tips of your fingers and to the tips of your toes. Totally relax. Another big, slow, deep breath in. Remember, each time you exhale, you deepen your relaxation even more. And 
Another big, slow, deep breath. As you breathe out, you feel your body, your mind relax even more and more and more. Now, I want you to focus on something you want to let go. Take a big deep breath in and breathe in that awareness. Good. Now take another big, slow, deep breath. And as you do that, bring all the worst parts of that event or whatever it is to the surface. Maybe it's something someone said or did. Maybe it's something you did or didn't do. Bring up all the worst parts of that, everything that you want to let go that you no longer want to hang on to. And just allow all the emotions to come to the surface anything tied to that if you're crying it's okay it's okay just allow just allow Just feel those emotions. It's okay. It's okay. These are the ones you don't have to hang on to anymore. Now take another big, slow, deep breath. As you breathe this in, become aware of the first time you felt this way. It may be the same time. It may be an earlier time or a different time. Just become aware of the things happening in that moment. Trust whatever comes to mind first. Now take another big, slow, deep breath. And as you exhale, just become aware of anything you told yourself in this moment. Just become aware of the story that you told yourself, any thoughts, beliefs that you've taken on as that younger version of you. Maybe you think what happens is your fault. Maybe you're not feeling worthy or deserving of something. Maybe you're feeling responsible. Just become aware of anything that you told yourself. Now take a big, slow, deep breath. Now that you know what you know now, what do you want to tell yourself? What new belief, what new story does that version of you need to know? You don't have to be stuck in that place anymore tied to that emotion.
Now that you know the truth, you can release this. You no longer have to take this on anymore and keep carrying this. Now imagine you have a balloon. Imagine you have a balloon and now take a big deep breath in and collect all those emotions, all those feelings. Bring them to the surface and bring them into your lungs with the breath. And then as you exhale, blow them into the balloon. Blow as hard as you can. It's okay if you're crying. And then another big, slow, deep breath. Pull them all into your lungs from all the parts of your body. If parts of your body are trying to get your attention, pull the emotion from there into your lungs and breathe out again. <sighs> breathe till you have no more air left in your lungs. And then another big, deep breath. Blow it out, blow it out, blow it out. Another big, big, deep breath. Any residual stuff, any pieces, and blow. Till there's no more air left in your lungs. Now you can tie it off or just let it go, whatever feels right. Allow the wind to take it. Watch as it drifts and floats away. This is no longer a part of you. When it's disappeared or you can no longer feel it, take a moment to take a big, long, slow, deep breath and breathe in this calm, peaceful feeling. And as you exhale, just allow it to absorb into all the cells of your body, from your head down to your toes, and anchor this in on a deep, deep, deep level. One more time, breathe in that calm, peaceful feeling. Just allow it to soak into all the parts of your body, permeating every part of your body, radiating out, growing and intensifying that peace, calmful feeling. This is you at the core. You no longer need to carry this. Remember this feeling. Anytime you feel these things coming up again, you can remember this feeling and go back to this moment. Now, whenever you're ready, you can gently come back and open your eyes, feeling freer and lighter than ever. Thank you for joining me on this little journey. Uh, if you feel this helped you, let other people know. Share this with other people. And I'd love to hear your comments on this below. This one just felt really good for those people that have a hard time visualizing because you don't have to do any of that. And it really can be that simple. I'm also curious to hear about anything that you modified. Uh, things that you changed that you thought worked better. Uh, hopefully this helps some of you and we'll see you on the next video.